Today, we're playing some more Sims 4. If you haven't watched the last video, um, hi, I'm Cursed Wolfhead. <laughs> I usually make, um, gaming videos, and if you're into that kind of stuff, feel free to check out my other videos. And if you like them, feel free to subscribe. Anyways, basically this is our uh, friend, Roach, and everyone they know is fucking Peter Griffin. Well, almost everyone they know is Peter Griffin. I have no idea who the hell this guy is. But it's not so bad. We befriended some Peters and, um, killed a Peter. And unfortunately, we have a violent reputation from that. But honestly, that's all fine. You'll get over it eventually. Are you- No. Did you not learn from the first time when you pranked the toilet? Roaches- Well, that's on you, buddy. Literally, why the fuck would you do that? You're the only person who shits in that toilet. Everyone else in this town is a fucking vampire. Anyways, Roach's aspiration is to be the public enemy. So I guess that means we gotta kill some more Peters. And honestly, I think we can do that. I don't think it'd be too difficult to do that. Look at these Peters. Aren't they so beautiful? Don't you wish everyone in our world was Peter Griffin? And they all looked like this? Roach can buy a voodoo doll now. We could definitely use that to fuck with some Peters. The voodoo doll can only be bound to nearby non-child sims. Okay, but can you bind it to Peters? I need to know. Now. <laughs> Stay out of my house, Peter, if you know what's good for you. When will you learn? When will you fucking learn? No. You know what, since you want to prank toilets so bad, let's go to our neighbor's place. Hey Peter, remember that time I stabbed that Peter to death in that bar? That was quite hilarious, wasn't it? Yeah, we should do things like that again. Well, it seems like he's forgotten about it. I think he hated that other Peter too. And honestly, I don't blame him. That Peter was a dick. Where did this Peter come from? These Peters are terrifying. Like, they just appear out of nowhere. Who is this other Peter? Oh. <laughs> I didn't even tell them to do anything. They just did it on their own. I guess they're just learning to accept the Peters. I guess you gotta if you want to live in this world. Wait, where did the other Peter go? What? What? Peter, where's your suit? <laughs> what is going on here? You know, I probably should rename him so I can be able to distinguish him from the other Peters. Um, I guess I'll call him my Peter Griffin. You know they're vampires, right? They're not even going to shit in that. You know what, whatever. It's for the next human visitor that comes. <laughs> I just love the way how his entire body clips through the blanket. Like, he doesn't even fit under there. You know what? I think I should play a song for the Peter. To help him calm down a little bit. Because apparently he's afraid of this thunderstorm. So what you guys think about the music? Oh. <laughs> what is going on here? They're fusing together. How's the acoustics pa back there, Peter? Do they sound amazing? <laughs> oh. <laughs> he doesn't even sit in the chair. Are you enjoying that book, Peter? Well, we've definitely made things better here. Maybe we should grace someone else with our presence. You know what, since we fucked up at the bar last time, maybe we should go back there and make amends. What the hell? Who are you? Peter Griffin. Huh. It's like the infection is spreading. Who's this? Peter Griffin. You know, I probably should stop asking because clearly everybody in this town is Peter Griffin. Even if they don't look like it, they're Peter Griffin. How do we know Brooks isn't Peter Griffin? Maybe deep down, we're all Peter Griffin on the inside. Maybe I should introduce myself to the bartender. Hi, you might remember me from the time I committed murder here. Wait. 
Who's that? Let me guess, you're Peter Griffin too. Leah Appleton. And she's a rising star? What the fuck? I thought everyone was Peter Griffin. Am I being scammed? I was gonna say we should probably befriend that not Peter over there, but honestly, I don't feel like it. We probably should befriend all the Peters if we want to get far in life. Like, who knows what would happen if you fuck with one Peter. All the others might kill you, and I don't want that. And I'm sure you don't want that either. <laughs> hey, I heard you became friends with my Peter Griffin. He's pretty cool. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You know what, forget all the Peters. This is a, the worst character. Fucking Amoga's crewmate. Well, thankfully, nobody remembered us there. And I think it's better off that way. Wait, that's a fucking teen! Does it, you know this is the house of someone who committed murder, right? You know what, since you need to be disliked by- Wait, who's Peter? Peter Griffin and I had just had a blast together. Thank you for your advice. I don't know which Peter it was, but I'm glad that happened. Anyways, since Roach needs more enemies, I probably should start picking on Eggman over here. You know, you're the worst Sonic the Hedgehog character. Like, you're not even an animal. You're fucking human. Anyways, if you can excuse me, I have a real job to attend to. Where the fuck are your parents? Like, did they send you here to mess with the murderer? Like, that's, talk, talk about irresponsible parents, am I right? Aw, my Peter Griffin came over to visit. How nice of him. You know, maybe we should get him to move in. I don't know, I feel like it'd be a good idea. We could be able to, like, do research on him and see what makes Peter tick. No, yeah, let's ask him to move in. Plus, his name is my Peter Griffin, so we'll know that he's our Peter Griffin and not any other Peter Griffin. We'll even take all their money. Thanks, Peter Griffin. Wait. Wait! <laughs> Apparently he has a job as a salary person. What are you doing here? You should be at work. There. Now no one else can get hurt. <laughs> Wait, what's he doing? What are you doing? Who are you calling? Oh, he called the police. Quickly, lock the doors. Lock the doors. Hello, officers. Um, there's nothing illegal going on here. I'm just made a containment chamber for my Peter. See, he's doing quite fine. I'm not doing anything bad. <laughs> Listen, you can't save him, even if you tried. See, this is why I built the cage for him. Like, I can't believe he would betray me like that. Yeah, you can just rot for the rest of eternity in there, Peter. I don't give a shit about you. A child. Wait, so what you're telling me is... Mario is a child? And all this time I thought he was a fully grown man? Do the Marios... Grow up into Peters? We need to run some more experiments. Maybe we should have Peter breed with another Peter and see what happens. But honestly, I'm still mad at him for what he did. Like, look at this shit. Why would you do this to your own friend? You know, I've had enough of this shit. Get off my fucking line. There we go. No, the, now the cops are dead. <laughs> Aw, rest in peace, Peters. This is so tragic. Well, I guess it's safe now. See, Peter? You did this. You caused more death. Do you feel bad? I'll leave these gravestones out there as a warning to the other Peters as to what will happen. <laughs> Grim's watching TV. <laughs> wow, the Grim Reaper is just like the rest of us. He likes to watch TV shows about a little girl... Sneaking a horse into her house? Can you please leave? Your job is done. Oh. Looks like Grim wants to talk to us. Bye-bye, Grim. I have to go to work now. I guess I'll see you at the next murder? Well, Peter, looks like you're alone for now. Crisis! Half the crew wants to wear ski masks to the next, next heist. Half insists on clown masks. Get involved! We're wearing clown masks! Aw, ski masks. But hey, we gained quite a bit of performance. Wait. Wait. You're not a Peter. Well, I hope the virus doesn't get you too. Cause like, look what happens. <laughs> They're like zombies. 
sorry, no one can get you to you right now. They're out right now. Okay, what are Peter's traits? He's materialistic, ambitious, and a foodie. And he doesn't like video games. You know, I was mad at you earlier for calling the cops on me. But honestly, I have even more reasons to hate you. Like, how could you hate video games? You're the worst. Oh, hey, Roach, welcome back. They got promoted as a criminal. Well, that was fun. I can't wait to see what else Roach will get up to. Well, I know that Harvest Fest thing is up next, so maybe we could do something with that. I guess we'll know next time we have more encounters with Peter Griffin.